guess would stand or keep our consistency from the first half into the second half with the ball pressure, our defense, our physicality. Um, and then ultimately, we didn't really make enough shots towards the end. Um, so this kind of consistency throughout the whole game and giving us a good chance to win. Those three things you said, defense, ball pressure, physicality, when they let up, did that also impact you guys getting out on the floor and getting to offense going? Yeah, um, because when you know they're scoring a basketball, and we got to get it out. They're able to set their defense, uh, so you know it limits our, you know, our fast pace. Um, but you know, even on makes, you know, we can still get it out fast and figure out and play, you know, free. How much did you know about Zach Lee before he came over to the national team? Um, I knew he was seven feet. I knew that, you know, not usually a lot of Canadians uh, are tall. Um, but I knew he was killing it in, in Purdue. Uh, and then when he came to national team, I got to get to know him. You know, uh, good kid, loves the game, loves the work. Uh, and I'm glad, you know, he's on a, you know, Memphis team where you know, they got good trainers, you know, good staff. and. Is able to grow. Is that somebody that you were following last year after you did play with him? Yeah, for sure. Um, watching him dominate, you know, the collegiate level. Uh, play well with those guys at Purdue. Uh, I was kind of upset that you know he didn't, he didn't come to the Olympics. But you know, as a you know, professional and as a man, you get to choose what you want to do. And you know, I don't knock him on, you know. Um, getting his professional career going, being with the team. Uh, but, you know, uh, great guy, um, great professional. And, you know, those guys are gonna love playing. What, what, do you, what type of challenges does he pose at the NBA? Um, he's a presence in the paint. Uh, any mismatch, a lot of mismatches for him in the post. Um, high low reactions, uh, good lob threat. Or you know, Ja, and you know, I would say, you know, as a seven footer, you know, he's pretty mobile, getting up and down the floor. Of course, you were able to play Memphis a few times last year. Is it still the same level of excitement playing on this time around, or is it just like another game on the schedule? So it's always going to be excitement uh, for me, uh, seeing those guys again, over and over, um, seeing the growth. You know, Ja's playing now, so. It's going to be a good game and, a, you know, a very competitive one as well. Thank you. Right, thank you. Appreciate it.